In recent weeks, at least 20 dead bodies, some badly mutilated, have been retrieved from a river in western Kenya. A human rights group on a fact-finding mission raised the alarm over the increasing number of unidentified bodies fished from the river. Kenya's clamor for an investigation into the mystery bodies dumped in the river, as the river serves as a means of livelihood to residents in the region. New Centre's Ni Omoni has the details. Some of the images you're about to see might be disturbing. Viewers' discretion is advised. This is River Yala. It generally flows fast over a rocky bed through a wild valley before joining the Inzola River to form a Yala swamp on the border of Lake Victoria. Being one of the major rivers in Kenya, many families depend on the river mainly for agriculture and fishing and is therefore a source of livelihood for a vast number of families. But for months now, a bigger threat is emerging. Mystery dead bodies. The human rights group on a fact-finding mission raised the alarm over the rising cases of mutilated bodies recovered from the river. We have seen for ourselves bodies tied with ropes, bodies that have been severely tortured, some of them with dismembered lip, limbs. What we know is that there is a double cabin and a pro box that have been spotted on different dates. Uh, individuals dumping bodies or at the bridge into River Yala. At least 20 dead bodies have been retrieved so far as the water body gains a reputation as a river of death. The police are aware of the situation. There have uh, been reported sightings of uh, bodies in uh, River Yara. And what we are doing, uh, the, the OSPD for the area that is Yala, that is Game Sub County, as a clear instructions together with the, the DCAO for the area uh, to go a little bit deeper and find out what is happening. It appears that there could be more bodies to be discovered in this river, which is why Kenyans are demanding investigations to ascertain the identities of the dead and know those behind the killings. Ni Omoni. New Central.